Trust your intuition. This is page 104 of the Free Your Energy book, and it says, always trust your intuition when it comes to people. If your trigger goes off and you think, damn, this, something's wrong with this person. This, this person is dangerous. I, I, I don't like their behavior. I don't like how they said that one thing. Never ignore that. That is your intuition. Do not ignore that. Ignoring yourself here could be catastrophic and you are a powerful enough person who should be aligned and in tune with yourself at all times. So in my opinion, to, to free your energy, part of freeing your energy is trusting yourself, trusting your intuition, trusting your ability to see people's true colors, trusting your ability to sense a vibrational energy that a person has and then adjust your life based on what, what you sense or what you feel. Now, the devil's advocate to this will say, well, what if your feeling is wrong? Or what if you don't trust yourself? And I think that those are both great questions. So if your sense is wrong, in most situations, you have the ability to observe people. If you cannot come to a judgment that you can trust, then you must then observe, really just watch. And if that means literally watching someone with your eyes in order to protect yourself, you must do that. So I'll give you a quick story. I was in the grocery store the other day buying some chips and there was a guy, his energy was off. It was just, it was just something about him was off. I could just sense him, I felt him. And I made sure that I never had my back to him 100%. I always stood at an angle where I could see him out the corner of my eye. Come to find out what ends up happening is the clerk comes over uh, or security, one of the people who work there. And they're like, hey, man, you got to go. You got to get out of here. You got to get out of here. You have to leave. This gentleman was in this location stealing before. So they have already kicked him out. So they were kicking him out again. And now he's getting into it with the clerk and he's, well, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. You mother. So that's a perfect example of how you got to just trust your energy. Right. So in that situation, that was with a stranger. But let's just say. Somebody, you know, well, what do you do? Well, in that situation, you really do have the ability to observe them because you know them. So you're either with them directly because of your choice or indirectly, because maybe you guys have the same friends or you're at the same school, live in the same apartment complex. When it's an indirect thing and you're not choosing to be around them, it's a lot easier to watch, to observe. But if you're choosing to be around this person, that's actually a good thing. Let me tell you why. If you're choosing consciously to make a choice to hang out with this person, see this person, and you still have those triggers, you still have those those red flag alerts. Now you have the ability to look this person in their eye and ask them questions. You have the ability to ask them open ended questions so they can tell you stories, tell you what they think, tell you how they feel, tell you their perspective. Ask them. You can ask them questions like, well, what would you do in this situation? Those are some of the best questions you can ask someone if you're looking to learn who a person is. You want to ask them, what would you do in this situation? And then you just have to be creative enough to figure out what to ask them so you can get the information needed so you can make sure you're making healthy decisions for your own life. That first quote I read was from the Free Your Energy book that's available on Amazon.com right now. You can get that from the link in my bio. Also, if you didn't know, I have a new course out that a lot of people are loving. It's called How to Stop Overthinking. Another course that I have is called Deep Healing. Both of those courses will help you with this subject of just trusting your intuition, finding yourself. How to Stop Overthinking and Deep Healing, those are also available via the link in my bio. And I hope you continue to free your energy.